So I'm just having some oatmeal first for lunch because I haven't eaten. Oops. Mm. What a fun start to a video. She's a mummy too. Yay! <laughs> Welcome back to my channel for a new video. So as you can already tell by the title, today's video is gonna be a haul. And it's not just any ordinary haul, it's a CMI haul. So as you have seen through my vlogs, I have been shopping a lot. Of course, I have to make a haul. A lot of you have been asking me to do a haul too. So here it is, a haul for you to watch. So without wasting any more time, let's just jump right in. So there's like three categories, there's clothing, makeup, there's accessories. So I think I'm just gonna start off with clothing first because I'm actually wearing it right now. The first item that I'm gonna show you is this sleeveless top which I absolutely love. And it's just in this really muted brown, really really neutral and I love this shirt so much. When I went into the shop, I saw this, I was like, I'm gonna get it. But of course, I did went into the fitting room and try just to make sure it looks good on me. Because sometimes, you know, it looks good on the hanger, but when you put it on, it just looks so different. It's like, <laughs> I'm not gonna wear it. So you all know me, right? When I love a certain top, I have to get it in all colors. So I went and got another color. Ta-da! Black. I know this is supposed to be like a CNY colorful haul, but they literally only have these two colors. They also have yellow, but my mom said not to get yellow because, I don't know, yellow just doesn't really look good on me, I think. I wanted like red because I saw online like those Insta shops, they have red. Ah, I'm so bummed that they don't have it at the shop. If I'm not mistaken, it's 29 ringgit for one, which is really, really affordable. I don't know, don't you realize that I seldom wear sleeveless shirts? You know, I wasn't confident enough, but now I feel more confidence so I'm gonna wear more slippers top now. It's so nice, Malaysia is so hot. By the way, I bought it from Honey BB. It's at Fahrenheit. So yeah, I bought that. It's all free size. And moving on to the next shop, which is actually just a floor above Honey BB, which is called Miraculous. I love everything at Fahrenheit because their clothes there are all like K-fashion, which is more to my kind of style. And they're really, really affordable, really, really cheap. So the next item that I bought is, no surprise, another sleeveless top. Just told you, I, I'm gonna wear more sleeveless top now, guys. I don't know why, but I'm always drawn to like pastel color, especially pink. I'm always drawn to like muted pink, pastel pink, and just pink, you know? It's just a really like presentable tank top. So yeah, I bought that. From the same shop as well, I bought a denim skirt. You all know I love my denim skirt, right? And also embroidered stuff. So this is just like the perfect one because the embroidery on it is like really, really soft, very silver, very chill and muted and dainty. I literally used so many descriptive words just for this denim skirt. But yeah, I really love it. When I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh. And the last piece from the same shop, just gotta have some red guys, have to. So it's actually this dress look i don't know why but i just love red in general i like how red looks on me when i first saw it i was like uh, kind of feeling you know i absolutely love it when i tried it i also tried it in yellow but as i've already told you yellow doesn't look good on me so yeah i bought this red one i love it so freaking much the last clothing item is actually this sleeveless high neck tank top this is once again another thing that when i saw it i was like i'm pretty sure i love it so i went and try and i love it and it was the only one left yeah i have a shoe that i bought remember when i went to Vinci, guys the stuff have arrived so if you watch my vlog you will know that i have been looking for a pair of loafers look at it I love it so much. I have been searching for the perfect one for months, actually since last year. I also got it in pink, but it's actually not with me yet. Um, but I already ordered it, but it's not here. It's in a light pink and it's so freaking pretty. So at days when I want to be like, you know, dark like this, I can wear the black one. And then on days, more to the pastel sweet side, I can put on the pink one. And the pink one is so pretty. Just imagine how pretty are they gonna look. Oh my gosh, they are so pretty. And then I've got another bag from Vinci. It's another backpack. I don't know, I just love backpacks. So this is a... What is this? It looks so freaking cute. So I actually called my mom like, Mom! Then I put this on, she was like, Oh my gosh, it is so pretty, you should get it. I'm like, yes, we should get it. The material is kind of weird. It's like very floppy. So when you open it, it's like very... It's like no structure kind of thing. You get what I mean? But I love it. Just like a... 
one compartment kind of thing. So as always, accessories. We got to start off with Luvisa first. So they have that 3 for 45 ringgit deal kind of thing, right? So the first item that I got from the tree is actually this choker. This is a really dainty rose gold sparkly one. Then the next item are actually this pair of earrings. They are just like broken heart ones, which is so freaking cute. Look at it. Oh my gosh! So I have to get it. I just love quirky stuff, so I bought that. I'm pretty sure you would have guessed I bought it through my vlogs. I got it in a hot pink one as well. I just really love this one. I feel like I'm gonna get all of the colours because as you already know, if I like a certain thing, I just want to collect everything. All the colours. So yeah, I love this so much. The next item is actually from Forever 21 and it is this super duper huge earrings. I have been looking for this type. Like a hoop with wordings in the middle, like cursive letter. So this just says love and it is so pretty and it's actually kind of huge though but i love it so much and the last pair of earrings that i bought are actually these look at it so pretty i wanted to get like some blue colors in my earrings kind of thing so yeah i found this and these are literally so cute because they have like pink tassels at the bottom it's just so pretty so we're gonna move on to makeup surprisingly i bought tons of makeup i just have been loving makeup so i went into sephora the other day and i just have been wanting to get a nyx product everyone knows it's the cheapest makeup over there i thought i would just start from there first then slowly moving on up you know what i mean i'm actually wearing the lipstick now Mm -hmm. This is their NYX Lingerie Liquid Lipstick. Yeah, Liquid Lipstick. And this is in the shade 06 Push Up. I just like it. It's kind of like nudish, but it's also not. At first I thought it was nudish, but then when I brought it back home, it's actually not. But I still really love it. But I don't really like it because it's like very, very drying. Just like any other ordinary liquid lipstick, but yeah, it's drying. I went to Guardian. There was this few days that they were having this 50% off. Like literally, the sales was crazy and everyone went crazy. No joke. So I picked up a few things. The first thing that I bought from the sales is actually Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. I'm pretty sure you know mine dried up. I've been waiting to, you know, restock them. And this is just like the perfect timing because it's literally 50% off guys. 50% off the original price. I wasn't planning to get this because I really have my Daiso one but then I was like, oh my god, it's 50%. Let's just get it. So I bought it. And the next item is actually from... Can make. I got it in the shade 01. I love this one a lot. I actually put it on today. It's just really, really natural and I love it. Because mine broke, so I needed new bronzer, so I bought it. I was really making full use of the sales and just get stuff that are broken, dried up, or that I don't have. Yeah. And also restock some stuff. And the next item is also from Can Make. This is their gloss eyeshadow. I got it in the shade 02. 02. Basically, let me show you. You squirt it on your hand. It's supposed to be on your eyelids, but let me just show you on my hand. Then you just apply it. Look, it's like really, really pretty. So you know some days when you are just in a rush and you have no time to put on like actual eyeshadow, but you still want to look good and you still want some eyeshadow on, you can just pop this in your eyelids and you're ready to go and put on some mascara and pop up, you're done. And they also have it in a bronzy shade, but as I've already told you, I prefer like pinkish, pinkish shade. Maybe I will get it next time. Yeah, I will get it next time. I was just like really trying out, see how I really feel about makeup first. This was also 50% off. From Can Make as well, I just have been loving Can Make a lot recently. I bought their Perfect Stylist Eye Eyeshadow in the code 14. I've already did a makeup look on this eyeshadow palette. If you haven't seen it already, I will leave the card up here. Make sure you go and watch it. It's like a pinkish Valentine's Day makeup look and I really love how it turned out. So it will mean a lot if you go and watch it, if you haven't watched it. I actually bought this before the 50% sales. It was 52 ringgit full price. I was kind of bummed but when I went to the sales right, this was already sold out. Literally sold out. This was selling like hot pancakes. I'm still glad that I got it before the sales. <laughs> and the last item that I got is actually this L'Oreal lipstick in the shade Beige Couture 232. And I actually bought this for my mom. This is just a really, really 
pretty pinkish so i wanted to search for a good lipstick for my mom so i thought why not make full use of the sales get a l'oreal one so i bought her that and it was 19 ringgit after discount which is really good all the four items here in total they cost me 80 ringgit just imagine without the sales it would have been crazy from daiso i also picked up a few makeup products the first one is actually a mascara but it's not with me and i'm so tired of walking around and i'm so lazy to get it but i've used it in my valentine's day makeup video so if you want to look at the mascara just head over there but i'm too lazy to get it right now and the next item that i pick up is this wow that's quick i was really like prepared down here to show this eyeshadow brush i was just like trying out this is really really hard it's like rock it's literally like rock guys i hate it i like their blusher brush but not this one hmm Next item is actually some eyelash. I have been looking for like really really natural eyelash that are short at the front and long at the back. Those fluttery ones and ah, I found them. And I just can't wait to put them on and try them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the last item that I bought from Daiso are just some hairpins. The 50 hairpins in a box thing and look it's literally almost gone. No matter how many you get, they are always missing. I don't know why. So those are all the items that I bought for Chinese New Year. Not actually for Chinese New Year but during that period of time. Yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want more haul, no actually. If you want more haul, you're just gonna make me shop more. Hmm. Not sure whether is that a good idea. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video give this video a huge thumbs up just want to wish you guys happy chinese new year not sure is it still gonna be chinese new year when this video is up i'm not sure when am i uploading this but yeah anyway happy chinese new year that's all i know subscribe to my channel if you haven't already subscribe over here i hope you have been loving my chinese new year vlog so far and yeah that is all mm -hmm. and i will see you in my next video bye